Oh, I just got an achievement. Sneaky. Hi, it's Nine Seventy Five, and welcome to Elite Dangerous on the Xbox One. And today I've got a fun clip for you and a really super annoying clip for you. So the fun clip is me trying to pirate this ASP. This guy knew what he was doing. He was really slippery. Um, he gave right in the slip. He was so difficult. He, he, oh, he was just absolute nightmare to try and hatch breaker. He was super, super difficult. Um, he was jumping in and out of the system crazily. Um, he was running the the rares. So this was the rares CG. Again, there'll be a lot of piracy from the rares CG because it's rares CGs are what pirates live for. Um, small, high, you know, small amount of cargo, high value cargo. Lots of commanders coming in and out in mediums, packed to the gills, 50 tons at a time. It's yeah. it's beautiful. That's what you want. And people were running doing the lave loop because it was five million a run. I did it myself in a Type Six lots. It was, you know, a really quick, simple job, and five million a run uh, towards the CG. Uh, but this guy, this guy was slippery. This guy was a cool customer. He knew what he was doing. Um, he was constantly jumping out before the hatch break. He could get its work done. There was, you know, he did all the things right that you want to see in a commander that you want to try and pirate it's just really good to see he, you know he really um gave us the run around um works really hard and um as you can see we're sort of just sort of shooting at him thinking about trying to take his drives out but when he get his shields down he was you know that sort of bounce in bounce out type of guy um this time though he makes the mistake of turning around and starting shooting back at me uh, which means I do get the hatch breaker off, and once I get the hatch breaker off, I'm not worried anymore about shooting him. I have no interest in doing him damage. Um, I did have this moment though. This was really annoying. That's the mother load for a pirate. That that was a mother load of a Type Nine that I interdicted. Absolute mother load of um, rare goods. Couldn't believe it. Couldn't believe my luck, to be honest. Um, you know, when you interdict and scan up guy that's got that much cargo and you're messaging him saying, you know, stop, comply, and I won't shoot you, um, you're really optimistic and you hope it's going to be good fun, a bit of piracy, a bit of role play. I'm not going to ask for too much because I'm not too greedy. You know, I'm not going to try and drain him dry or take too much money off him, you know, because, you know, I'm a simple pirate. I'm not after a lot. I don't need a lot of cargo from you. Um, but instead, of course, the inevitable happens. Uh, the hatch breaker fails because he is no longer there. He's drifting off in a direction. But what do I expect? It's a shieldless Type 9 at a CG. Uh, I don't know why people are that greedy and run shieldless Type 9s. You can run plenty of cargo and still have very powerful shields. I know I do. Um, I never understand people who try to run, you know, shieldless and then combat log as soon as they get into any sort of entanglement what's the point if you're going to do that just play solo or private group save everyone the time the cg is going to be packed full of players a lot of those players are going to want to interact with you if you don't want to interact with them you have the option not to consenting to playing open is consenting to player interaction i'll be honest i totally expected the the commander in the shieldless type 9 to log as soon as I launched the hatch breaker then pit. I kind of knew by the way his ship was drifting across space like that, that he'd already combat logged. But I contented myself dealing with very difficult to interdict commanders in very small ships who were running very fast. Uh, it was a fun CG. I had lots of fun. I pirated lots of commanders. I didn't have a single salty reply to my GG's yarns and pirate roleplay. Everyone took it really well. It was that kind of event because it was only a few jumps to go get 50 more tons of rares or 46, I think, or 48 tons of rares that spawns at it lave. Nobody was really that worried about losing the odd ton to a couple of crazy pirates. Everyone had fun. It was great times had by all. So that's pretty much it for this video. I'll leave you with a clip of me actually getting cargo from this guy and say that's all. Thanks for watching. Nice.
He's faster than me. There's a guy behind. Easy now. Nice. 